Hi, it's Legina of Body Lux, www.bodyluxxc.net, and I am a handmade creator of all things body butter, soaps, candles, you name it. Today, I wanted to do a quick review of one of the vendors that I'm, I'm currently using. Um, her name is Mika, and her company is called Maryland Wax Company. She's out of the DC metro area, and she's got some new fragrances that I wanted to do a quick review of. Um, Here's the box that she sent over. And inside the box, I have my invoice. And let's see, I ordered Enchanting Woman, Vanilla Pod and Tonka, Fire Opal Gemstone, Sensual Jasmine, and Sandalwood, and Black Bougie Ode. So those are the two ounce samplers that I'm gonna take a quick sniff of um, just to give you a perspective of how they smell. Um, I've purchased fragrances from, uh, many of the top fragrance producers, Brambleberry, um, Bulk Apothecary, Candle Science, Lone Star, Aztec, just about anywhere you can purchase fragrances from for candles and other handmade items. So, um, that gives you a little context of, uh, the quality of the scents that I'm used to smelling. So... Let's go ahead and get started. So she's got the scents bagged up into a plastic bag, which is good. Uh, sometimes scents and fragrances will leak and leak onto other things and leak onto other fragrances and kind of make a mess uh, in the shipping process. So I'm glad she put these in a bag. Um, the rest of the bag just has packing peanuts. Rest of the box just has packing peanuts. Um, so the first scent that I'm gonna try is called Fire Opal Gemstone. And she also has the uh, utilization rates. There's a rate sheet for each of the fragrances. Uh, if you make different products, it's already posted online. Um, I've downloaded that for these um, in case I want to do some body butter or soaps or, you know, what have you. But I just want to get a good smell of it first. So, Fire Opal Gemstone. And Mika, don't get mad at me because I do not have the little scent strips uh, that you put in your instructions online that people should have the scent strips and have some coffee beans and, you know, do the whole thing. I'm just going to open these up. I'm about to go um, hang out in the Tampa area with my family. So I'm dressed up. I'm not, you know, actually doing any candle stuff today aside from checking out these fragrances. So Fire Opal Gemstone. That smells very good. I immediately smell kind of like a grapefruit. It's very fresh and clean. It, it definitely has a spa quality essence to it. I really like that. I think that would be awesome in a candle. I'm going to try it in candles. Um, but I would also like to do this in a foaming body scrub. So I do pink Himalayan sea salt or activated charcoal body scrubs and I think this would be really nice in one of those so I definitely like fire opal gemstone there's a lot of grapefruit and citrus um, it's not too husky it's very clean very spa like a spa day kind of scent love it next fragrance we have is vanilla pod and tonka mm. okay let's check that out Ooh, you know what? This kind of gives me like a cigar smoke shop smell. It's like you're drinking brandy, smoking a Cuban, you're a man with nice shoes, a great watch, an awesome belt, a 401k. That's what uh, this vanilla pod and tonka is giving it's giving a giving a male energy or a very yeah it's definitely giving a male kind of smoke shop energy that's what i get from that i would i would use that in products for men or women identifying as men hey whatever whatever floats your boat all righty so next i've got enchanting woman Oh, this is giving me 
a ritzy woman in ball and, and down in Miami on Miami Beach with a nice bag going out to eat. It's very rich. It's, it, I like Enchanting Woman. It smells like a lady that got an inheritance. <laughs> okay? I like that. I would use that and probably soaps, body butter, candle, body scrub. I'd do a whole collection with that. Enchanting Woman smells very good. Next, we've got black. No, I'm going to say black bougie old for last. Next, we've got sandalwood, sensual jasmine, and sandalwood. It gives a lot of sandalwood and jasmine. I like it. This would be great in a room spray. I do room sprays too. This would be a great room spray or car spray. I like that. I like that a lot. It's, it's giving a lot of jasmine, heavy on the sandalwood. Finally, I've got Black Bougie Ode. Oh. Love it. It's very grown. It's giving bougie black auntie vibes. I like it. Definitely feminine, but beautiful. Great job, Mika. I love all of the friends.